it's, it's a defensive uh, mentality to absolutely shut these guys down, All right? So let's watch and get better right now. I think the cops say that two-thirds of all eyewitness reports are incorrect. It's the same way in a basketball game. That's why the refs aren't very good. But uh, at the same time, I'm joking. Uh, at the same time, when you look at things, uh, film is a great way for guys to see uh, things visually. And there's a lot of different ways to learn. One is by doing it on the floor. Uh, one is by maybe taking notes and writing things down. One is by listening to your coach. But another one is that visual part of watching it. Don't bring your man into play. And then that's your chance to make a play, is to hop in there right away. When we get together as a team, I like to watch and compare and contrast us to other teams, us to teams before. For instance, uh, when we prepared for Creighton, we watched last year's team. And with the lack of pace we played at, it was really incredible. We just didn't cut hard. Uh, Creighton plays us very soft. Uh, we get very hesitant. And, uh, and we showed that on tape with guys that that's not a natural way um, to play. And what we can do to maybe alleviate that and to improve that. And we're not running it your way. Make the read, make the cut, read your defender. We don't really screen. We miss that screen. David kind of screens. And at least Siobhan drives hard. But look at our cuts. We'll watch our opponents and we'll watch their tendencies. You can't teach all your guys in two days all the different plays that team has. But if they know the personnel and they know the tendencies of what the uh, opponent's going to do, they can guard it accordingly and take away their strengths. Directly to the rim if you're ahead of everybody. That allows you in a short time uh, to put together a game plan because basketball is an uneven product. It's not like football where you play every Saturday and pretty much everybody's got the same amount of rest and routine and the way it goes. We could be uh, in Ypsilanti, Michigan one night and, and two nights later back in, in Lincoln playing a game. Uh, we could be in New York City playing at uh, 6 p.m. one night and noon the next day. You just never know uh, how your thing's gonna go. So you need to have a mechanism uh, to get your team ready to play in, in any circumstance necessary. And then we get the lane line drive and the foul. That's exactly what I want. I only wanted about six seconds quicker. Coach, did you see anything here? You gotta let me know. All right, very good job on this. Very good job. If you wanna be something special, you gotta be uncomfortable. You gotta work harder than you want to. You gotta will yourself sometime to play in a way that you're just not mentally ready to. But it takes some thought forward to do it. It takes some planning ahead mentally to have yourself ready. It takes some urgency, some excitement. That film, that knowledge that our guys can get from, can glean from that, uh, that, those discussions on game plan and how we put them into practice form and then game form are really critical to our success.